Wanna 10 extra hours this week? Stop giving vague prompts your AI. Today, I will show the five prompt elements that turn messy notes into business ready tasks and I'll prove it live. Copyable templates at minute six. Let's go. Quick question. What is a prompt? Most people say just ask ChatGPT, but prompts are actually mini spec sheets. Here is the plan. I'll break a prompt into five elements. Then I'll show the same meeting notes with and without each element so you can see the difference. We'll finish with a copy paste template you can use right away. Role, context, tasks and instructions, constraints or format, examples, output, specs. Those are five elements of a good prompt. Here is the raw input real and messy. Quickly go through the project description. Andre is our architect. All good. Uh, nice to meet you. How you doing? Dozens of lines of a text of more than an hour long meeting. It's real messy. We want action items with owners, deadlines, priority, and one sentence rationale. Here are two temporary ChatGPT5 chats. We will test prompts without optimization and with optimization side by side so you see the difference. Let's start by uploading the meeting notes that you just saw. One and second. So the prompt A goes, turn these notes into action items. Pipeline development. Build foundational modular engine for genomic pipelines. Implement FastQ. Prioritize pharmacogenomic pipeline. See generic bullets. No owners, no deadlines. Let's try a prompt with a role. You are a project manager at a startup. Turn these nodes into action items. Notice that here we gave a role to LLM. We said you are a project manager at a startup. Project manager is a person who collects requirements, writes meeting notes, action items with uh, owners and deadlines, manages communication, and then manages a kickoff and the further delivery of a project. So let's see how two responses are different. Must-haves. In the basic prompts, we see four general items. In our improved prompt with a role, we have more granular description of tasks, including annotation standards, storage and cost optimization, thanks to the role. Then nice-to-haves also are more granularly described. And pay attention to the final part, immediate follow-up. Here they are messy and Actually, all is not responsibility. Usually there must be one task owner. Here we have a granular task owners and tasks. Emmanuel should do this. Andri should do this. Alex was recognized as PM should do this. And Vinayak should do this. Also, we have here deadlines as much as possible tomorrow or agreed time. The value of this are fewer follow-ups and faster execution. Fewer clarification questions may save up 30 to 60 percent of time to you. Next, context. Without it, the model can hallucinate, invent facts and guess. Let's swap our chats. We will use the prompt with a role as a baseline and add a context. The context will be the following. Team members, Alex, project manager, our team, Andri, software architect, our team, Emmanuel, be informatician, client side, Vinayak, tech venture capitalist, client side. Today is June 25. Use these people only, turn notes into action items. Here we can see that now each milestone is broken down into a set of tasks assigned to a particular individual, like Alex draft a proposal, Emmanuel share the list of recommended interactions, Andri design modular pipeline architecture with focus on pharmacogenomics use case, and the same for each each task. At the end we see the communication and next steps summary, and we see that the follow-up call with Emmanuel is scheduled for tomorrow, June 26. So the date we gave, June 25, was taken into account to calculate the deadlines for the tasks. You saw how we added role and it helped. You saw how we added context and it helped. Now let's add a task. Let's get back to our comparison table, add the same file. For a comparison, we will use 
summarize and list next steps. Summary, core focus areas, phase planning, phase one, phase two, infrastructure considerations, reporting needs, collaboration, next steps, internal client joint. Third element is task itself. Precise instructions are equal to predictable output. Summarize next steps, produce a numbered action item list. For each item include short title, owner, deadline, priority, one sentence rational, output as a marked down table. In this case, we are asking chat to output an exact the format we want. No room for guessing. Yeah? Compare this to what we had earlier. Action items. Phase one, sample clinical report confirm technology, database selection, internal proposal drafting, who is the owner, what is the deadline, priority, also ranked by priority, see from high to medium, and rational, agreement to focus on phase one, needed to clarify fixed versus flexible report sections, etc., etc. See, when you specify the expected output format, you get exactly what you asked for. If you want CSV or JSON, just say it. Fourth, constraints and format. Constraints are something that the model shouldn't do. For example, do not invent deadlines. If unclear, write needs clarification. Yeah, because we see a lot of invented dates here. Format is the desired format of output. For example, format output as CSV with columns, we say give us the file with columns and explicitly list them. Title, owner, deadline, priority and rationale. Let's try this prompt. See, do not invent deadlines. If unclear, write needs clarification. We see the CSV generated, define phase scope, then comma, then who is owner, me, then deadline. Needs clarification because it wasn't explicitly discussed in our dialogue and the deadlines were invented. Then priority and rational. Priority high and rational, agreement to focus on phase one of a reporting. So the format we asked for and the constraint we asked for take into account and the structure we asked for. Constraints and format are less cleanup. Fifth and the most powerful are examples. One example row is often enough. When AI sees that row, it mirrors format, tone and punctuation. This cuts errors dramatically. So the example row in our case, create landing hero copy is the task, Maria is owner, this is the deadline, uh, this is the priority and this is the rationale. Let's copy it. So we see that the model follows the format given. Here is the task, here is the owner, here is the deadline, needs clarification according to our tasks above. Here is the priority and here is the rationale. One example equals to big improvement. Now watch everything combined. I'll paste the full prompt at the first comment to the video. So first, role. You are a project manager at a startup. Second, context, team members. Alex and others. Third, task, produce CSV with columns, format, title, owner, deadline, priority. Constraints, do not invent deadlines. If unknown, write needs clarifications. Example row, create landing hero copy, Maria, and you saw it. Output specification, CSV only, no extra commentary. Let's copy it. Title, owner, deadline, priority, rational. Define phase one versus phase two deliverables. Alex, date, needs clarification. Hi, needed to clarify. Design modular pipeline architecture. Andri, architect, needs clarification. Priority, hi, rational, ensures extensibility and supports intermediate checks. Import ready, no cleanup. You copy it and you can open it in your CRM right away. So you can see here a title, owner, deadline, priority, and uh, rational. Import ready, no cleanup. That's the power of combining all five elements. Estimated time saved, 30 to 90 minutes per meeting. Here is the template you can use. It will be in the comments. Replace the bracket parts with your actual inputs. You can paste it into your ChatGPT, Slack channel, your automation flow or whatever. Five common mistakes and how to fix them. If your prompt is vague, add task and format. If you have no role, 
add role to set voice of a response. If you miss a context, add people, date, whatever you think is required for the proper answer. If your output is not machine ready, require a particular format such as CSV, JSON or others. If your model hallucinates, add do not invent and an example. The one line that doubles productivity. If you are unsure, add a follow-up question instead of inventing. So add to your prompt the following line. If any item requires clarification, output needs clarification and include a suggested question to ask. That stops the model from guessing and forces a safe, verifiable output. If you want the exact prompts I used, I pinned them in the comments. Hit like if this saved you time. Subscribe for more AI for business workflows. Comment below what manual task should I automate next? I'll pick one and build the prompt live. Takeaways. Prompts are role, context, task, constraints, and examples. Add those five elements and your AI stops guessing and starts acting like a teammate. See you in the next one.